Alright, that's creepy as fuck. You think that's what the Joker sees when he falls asleep? Oh, my nuts need adjusting. Where's my beer at? <clears throat> hey Anna, how you doing? You alright? Alright, Supermassive, calm down. Oh, hello. Oh, hello as well. Oh, god damn. Hello, not Peter Storm eh? Okay. So there is a bit of... Oh, these guns look nice. They've got a nice pattern. Alright, so this is me playing Until Dawn Rush of Blood for the first time. And if your arm position does not match that of the character play, you can extend your arms, then press and... Alright, that's just it. Alright, I know where my arms are physically. They are about... But thankfully... Due to my armrest, I can just do this like a motherfucker. So, yeah. Thanks to armrest, it's not going to look as janky as going... <coughs> Got that. Uh, let's go there first. Audio. Are subtitles on? Speaker type, headphones, yada yada, confirm, subtitles on. Uh, thank you. Confirm that shit. What are the controls on this bitch? Calibration. Alright, so... Are you steady on? Oh, the whole body? There we go. <clears throat> uh, no. New story. We're going to do... Uh, let's go normal. We're going to do... The first roller coaster ride, apparently there's like seven. And uh everyone watched the uh Let's Watch of Ryan Hayward doing this. And I will talk about that as I play it. <coughs> so we won't talk over the characters. And step right up to the ride of your life. There are wonders beyond this door that will test your skill and test your will. Do we have a winner here today? See the targets, shoot the target, and try your best not to die, of course. If it sounds simple, then by all means, show me what you're made of. All you have to do is point your weapon right over here at this sign and pull the trigger. Bring it. 
brought the game. You think I'm gonna stop, motherfucker? Anyway, I saw Ryan play this, and I've heard mixed reviews from friends that have this. And I will agree on one point compared to what my friends say. You're playing with PS Move controllers. They are PS3 tech. They are last gen tech. I'm on a PS4 with a VR headset. It's next gen tech with current gen tech. Using last gen tech to help calibrate all that shit. Uh, I was hoping for something else to come out for all this kind of gameplay. And hopefully something else still does come out that will replace the move controllers because PSVR World's London Heist. Does feel a bit janky at times. And there was a trophy that popped there. And uh, as I was saying, London Heist felt a bit janky. I did a Twitch stream of a... Batman Arkham VR and... Uh, it was janky at times. But... The way Michael and that lot were describing it on Off Topic, I didn't experience that level of jankiness. Bastard. I know you can do it. I believe in you. But it is a bit weird that you've got last gen tech configuring with next gen. Right, I feel like I'm chow young fat here. See, that I did not expect there. Everything drops up, my chest is out further than normal. Yeah, you die. Come on, my aim is terrible. That's how you chant fat. On a carousel and couldn't get off. Yeah, even with all the grease on the horse. <laughs> but yeah, I hope in the future they do. All right, all right. Just to warm it up. Just warm it up. I hope they do bring out something new for this other than. PS3 move because I had a few friends say oh you know PS move works great for it you seen how most of us oh fuck you who <laughs> but you still went through that wall there motherfucker Duck. come on oh there we go my arms are literally six inches further back. <coughs> Hello. Got ya, son of a bitch. Some days you just don't feel like one yourself, do you? But yeah, hopefully one day they soon, hopefully soon, come out with something that is more compatible with PSVR than just PS3 move controllers. Nice knowing you, kid. Cause <laughs> this works temporarily. And uh Oh <laughs> that actually feels pretty cool. Uh I would like to see something that's a bit more fucking compatible to say the least. But this feeling overall <clears throat> a 
Let's see if I can configure this so my body is actually in line. No, not even close. <laughs> Die, Mr. Robot. Ah, oh, now we've got a nice looking... And another trophy. Looks like we're on the wrong path. It seems we've landed on the old ghost train. Oh. All right, I'm going to do this cherry on fat style. Oh, I did not expect to see you there. Just sent the light down and there we go. Problem solved. I keep twisting the controllers in my hand and uh, by the way you'll notice this a lot I'll shoot more with my right hand than I will with my left Piss off See how long this lasts for. All right, arm, calm down. Spazzing out a bit. Let's give you a bit of a twist, bit of a config. Be quiet, damn it! Yeah, anyone else? Will you piss off? Come from the left at least. There you go. Shoot Hannah, she becomes one of them. Everything. Shut the fucking baby up as well. Bye bye. And you. Yeah, when you try and hold down options to reconfigure shit. I mean, for Batman, it works. What's the other game? London Heist. Holding down it works. My arms are far wide out here. As it looks. My arms look close here. My arms are wide out like a motherfucker. If I put my arms close in like that, it looks like I'm uh, chow yum fatting the motherfucker out of this shit. So, uh... Duck under that. Hey, Mr. Robot! <laughs> oh, I took your head off before you even dropped, motherfucker. Come on! I played London Heist and this was a bit that was a better shooter. The fuck you got. Although despite Alright, calm down. Hit that fast! There we go. I will say. Oh take me that way, you bastard. 
I shot those targets for nothing. I'm better with a gun in my right hand than I in my left. No, no. They got targets, come on. See? Oh, you can't shoot? Oh, alright then. Maybe not. Hang on. Uh, yep. Right. My arms feel like they're there. My legs, my body. I'm going to move forward in my chair a bit. There we go. Now this feels a hell of a lot better. So... I mean, initial reports were like, oh, just, uh, you've got to be like, a couple of meters, like two meters, three meters away. All I had to do was just move forward a few spaces and, I'm um, perfectly in place again. Oh! <laughs> that was the lamest scream I could give, but that was the most genuine. <laughs> Fucking got me. Sit back. Relax. Deep. Hey! Breath. The fuck kind of chair is this? B, fuck you, I lived. Bob Washington. Hang on. Oh, that's local. Friends, fuck you, Viper Strike. World, uh. I ain't even close. We'll continue on this. Hey, well, buddy. Now, listen up, listen up. Things have uh, we'll listen up in a minute, but I just recalibrated myself, and uh, it looks like I've gone back to uh, square shit. Calibration. Right, I'm going to get myself, according to the hologram that I can see, and you lot probably can't, Right. Extend your arms like the model, then press. You did not have this problem with Batman or the London Heist. Done. <clears throat> there we go, it feels better now. Stop janking. Motherfucker. Unexpected turn, and I'm the first to admit that we need things corrected. Now. There's just one more thing. Don't yeah, replace you with Peter Stormare. You've inhaled a gas. No shit. And while there's no harm in it, you may start to see things that aren't really there. Which is why I hesitate to bestow upon you this kind of firepower. But you'll need some protection. The cyclone is still at large, so I advise you move on. Ah, oh, double barrels. You get double double barrels. Alright, now I've recalibrated to what the hologram I saw. I don't know if you'll see it when the video comes out. But, yeah. It's now recalibrated, it actually feels in comparison to the screen like it's actually that way but 
as I'm gonna keep saying over, in comparison to Batman. <laughs> Dormez-vous. Dormez-vous. Gina. Dong. You motherfucker. Alright, that was unexpected there. <laughs> Uh, I still can't believe I remember that song from French class when I was a bloody child because I did not hear that in high school. Alright, calm down assholes. Move out the way. <sighs> Shut up. Too many squealing fucking pigs. I'm actually in my chair to get the fuck away from all these sores. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> uh, no. I'm actually moving back and forth. Can't believe I got those in darkness. Come at me, you bitches. I hear more squealing like a mother... Oh, it's you. Yeah, uh, all you got to do is just pause every now and again, which you shouldn't really have to, to recalibrate the controls. And let's go down! Oh, and in typical roller coaster ride... Shenanigans with me, I'll always have a few bevs before I go on a roller coaster. This looks fucking creepy. But, yeah, I've had a few bevs. Die. Ah, that beamed me right in the fucking head. It relies on a lot of physical head movement as well. Like VR Luge and Danger Ball. Oh, this looks fucking... What? Russia blood. But yeah. Oh. Hey, right, what? Oh. oh, there we are. Controls. Yeah, still working good. Body still looking in the same place. Yeah, this all feels well. Woo! Can I? No, not even close enough. Alright, this feels a bit awkward. This really does. Eh. Oh, God! Hey, Mr. Robot. Are you still a healer, man? Get out my fucking face. You son of a bitch. Go away, you fuck! Got him. No. No collectible there. Ow! Fuck off! Yep. Got you, bitches. No. All good. Alright. I do wish that they come up with some new controllers. I mean, this works for now, every now and then when you have to recalibrate, but... Die. <clears throat> I said die, motherfucker. Come on, reload! But... You know, they need to come up with something new. 
Otherwise, if you're just going to keep using last gen tech, you're going to be completely fucked! Four or ten, uh, that was shite. Actually, 83, okay, that's not bad. B plus, I'm getting better. And I think I will call that a day. With an accurate, mildly drunk assessment. Yeah, you upload the score, let's see how I did. Local, Bob and Josh Washington again. Oh, I wonder where all these names came from. Spoiler for people that never played Until Dawn. 216,300. Yeah, I'm nowhere going to be near there. Alright, so I will call that a day. And hopefully this video comes out. Depending on how the camera to VR headset ratio looks. Or whatever the fuck you want to call it. Uh, but now it's time to go and watch episode 2 of season 7 of The Walking Dead. Because, like, fuck am I going to miss that? See you all later.